Hello, I'm Mike Russell from musicradiocreative.com. I've had quite a few requests asking me to update my stutter effect video from 2010 in Adobe Audition CC. Quite a few things have changed since Adobe Audition 3, 1.5, even Cool Edit Pro. So let me show you how to do a few stutters. First of all, I'll pull in this voiceover. Stutter effect. Now, if I want to stutter maybe the S at the start of that voiceover, I'll just select it and then simply hit Command C to copy to the clipboard. Zoom out a bit, uh, place the marker exactly where I'd like to paste and hit Command V. Now, of course, that would be Control V or Control C on a PC. And then I'll just right click and drag that along so that you get the nice crossfade there. And then I can do it again and maybe one more time. There you go, and just even them out slightly so there's a nice even crossfade between each S. Zoom out and play back. Stutter effect. So there you go, there's the most basic stutter effect. Now, say you want to do a pitch shifted stutter effect. Well, let's go into this lovely voiceover I made earlier. Going down. And I'll just copy the D of down right here. Down. Okay, again, Command C to copy, and then I'm going to paste multiple times. Let's do it four times as I did in my previous tutorial. Then select all of those pasted downs. Down, 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 down. Then I'll go to the effects menu and I'll select time and pitch and I'll do stretch and pitch process. Now, my favorite preset here, cutting power should be selected and the initial stretch I'll start at 80% and then I'll stretch it down a few semitones to 130%. And as you can see in CC, it's updating in real time in the bottom window here what my audio is going to look like. Hit apply. And boom, there it is. Da, 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 da. Now you've got a different kind of going down pitch shifted. Going da, 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 down. Now we can uh, neat and tidy that up in the multi-track by dragging that in onto track one. And I'm simply going to zoom in and I'm going to place the marker here. And I'm going to hit Command K to make a cut. And then I'm simply going to drag these in to tighten up the stutter on this going down. Here we go. That's done. And again, you can see nice crossfades. Put the marker at the start, zoom out, and hit play. Going down. 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 And there's your pitch shifted stutter effect. And finally, as I demonstrated to you in my previous stutter effect tutorial of 2010 in Adobe Audition 3, I'm going to show you how to do some stuttering over a music bed. Here we go, let's drag one in. It's just a basic drum beat. That'll work nicely. And I've got me saying playing the biggest tunes. Have a little listen to this. Playing the biggest tunes. And now I'm going to stutter the B on biggest tunes. So let's delete a little bit of that audio there. And again, quite simply move this out. So let's move it onto that beat there, the first beat of the second bar. And then I'm going to copy that by Command C and paste on this beat here and paste on that beat there, and you'll hear a very basic stutter. Playing the bi bi biggest tunes. Now, if I want to take that stutter further, I can maybe drag that out so it's about a quarter of a beat, and then I can actually right click on the very top green bar here, and copy, and drop, and then just select copy here. Again, copy and drop, copy here, copy, and drop. Now it's not entirely accurate. If I had selected a quarter of a beat, it would nicely match up there, but you get the idea. Big, 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 biggest tunes. There's another stutter, but if I wanted to go even further, now this looks almost an eighth of a beat, just right click, copy and drop, copy here, copy and drop, copy here, copy and drop, copy here. I can even speed up the process by just selecting all of those little wave bits there, Command and C, and then place my marker where I want to drop, about there, paste, done. And then you'll get a sort of stutter effect that slowly gets faster and faster. Have a listen. Playing the big, 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 biggest tunes. And you get the idea of exactly what is possible inside Adobe Audition CC. Of course, if you take your time, you can be even more accurate than I was there. I hope this tutorial has helped you, and remember if you enjoyed it, leave a comment and let me know what you thought. I'm Mike Russell from musicradiocreative.com.